Uh, how you doing, fight fans? I'm Bob Arum, and welcome to Jay Cotto's Fight Page. And I'm going to show you today exactly one other example of having no class within the sport of boxing. Now, I for one sometimes talk out of the panel and of course sometimes I fly over the hinge. But that's besides the point. Where I'm getting at here is Angel Garcia courtesy of FightHype.com Cheap Shots Keith Thurman saying that his son, Danny Garcia, broke Keith one time Thurman's elbow. When we all know that Keith Thurman underwent surgery to remove some bone shards from his elbow. So, with that being said, I'm also going to show you exactly the dirty tactic that Angel Garcia used in cheap shotting Keith one time Thurman's wife as well. Now, I'm going to roll the tape. So what do you make of the whole situation that's going on with Keith and uh, him saying he doesn't want to fight Spencer? The reason why, but, well, he's messed up right now. He got an elbow, fucked up elbow. Danny broke his elbow, let's put it like that. Don't sugarcoat it. Yeah. Danny broke his elbow, and he's messed up. He has surgery, and then he went and married some back from some other country. He paid for the pussy. So. He married some bop from another country. And he paid for the pussy. Very, 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 very disrespectful. And it has no class. How do you guys feel about him fibbing on Danny Garcia breaking Keith one time Thurman's elbow? You know what I'm saying? Like, what the fuck? Just be straight up, man. <laughs> Stop being around. But the point is that if we fight him or not, he's still dead. His elbow, and he's messed up. He has surgery. And then he went and married some bop from some other country. He paid for the pussy. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, what the fuck? Just be straight up, man. <laughs> Stop being around. But the point is that if we fight him or not, he's still Danny Garcia. He will be champion again, I promise you that. In terms of, do you think he's, he's, he's going to be champion again, bro? It's just a matter of time. In terms of that situation, seeing that Danny did fight Keith, um, a lot of people are saying that he's scared to fight Spence, that he's avoiding Spence. Well, what do you as a business person, he's not scared like he said earlier. Yeah. He's not scared. It's just a business. He's looking at a business term. Because why would you take a fight when you messed up? He's messed up, bro. So he, never, he, he, he hasn't even definitely said he listen, he's not even fighting in March. No, that's not even listen, bro. He messed up. Bro. He yeah. just don't want to say he ain't the same man. Yeah. It's like when Bird ripped his muscle. Remember Bird? Yeah, he was never the same man. When you get injuries in this game, it's like a football player. If you get an injury enough to hurt you, you'll never be that football player again. Like that guy. So boxing the same way. It's a sport where you might come back, you might not come back. So big injury. That's a big injury, y'all. But remember, that's his right hand. So when you throw your elbow, it snaps. You said Danny, Danny broke his elbow. Well, yeah. Did you see what round or? You know, well, what, to me, it was the last the round, punch? the tenth. Yeah, it was the, the, he had him against the rope. Right. <laughs> okay, okay, children. Enough of the fairy tales. For this bedtime story, is making old Bob very sleepy. Yeah. Scratch my balls. Okay, now, the moral of the story is 
You have to have class. You had to fight when you had to fight. And you're still salty over the loss that Keith Thurman gave to your son. And I have to say, it was very impressive.